Hey guys, Dungeon J here. Today I'm going to go ahead and start a, a, a playthrough of Rage with uh, the recent uh, speculation that there could be actually a Rage 2. I thought that it'd be pretty cool actually to do a gameplay of it. I've never played the game, so this is actually kind of exciting, guys. We're going to go ahead and see how exactly it's all set up. If you guys didn't know, there was a recent leak from a Walmart associate in Canada, and it seems that uh, ID Software is going to be doing Rage 2. Now, this is speculation. And if that's the case, I want to go ahead and actually play Rage before Rage 2 comes out. And it looks like Borderlands 3 might be coming as well. These are all games that I'm interested in. I mean, I also like like Mass Effect and stuff like that. So this is definitely something to wet the whistle, so to speak. All right, looks like shit done got fucked up. Let's see what it's all about, guys. I'm not sure of uh, even the controls, really. First time, play through it. All right, so this is from the Eden Project. External disturbance detected. Cryogenic chambers compromised. Chamber Omega-5 online. Initiating emergency nanotrite activation. Three, two, one. Nanotrite sequencer online. Release cryogenic chamber seals. Alright, let's do this. Nominal. Reloading internal data systems. Alright, I guess so. Seems like the mouse actually is a little fast, so I'll have to adjust that. Let's go ahead and go to settings, keyboard and mouse, key mouse sensitivity, turn it down just a little bit, sounds good to me, back out of there, back out of there, let's resume. Also it looks like I might have to do something with um, the video. Go ahead and turn on the vertical sync. All right. Let's go ahead and resume the game. There we go. That looks a little better. and open this sucker up. Oh, this is so Fallout right here. That's beautiful though, guys.
Save the day, man. It ain't safe here. Get in. I know you got questions, but we gotta get moving. Got the end of this all over these hills. We best get going. You gonna fill me in, bud? I like the little bobblehead. Hold on, got bands. Damn shame you're still wearing that arc suit. It's a dead giveaway. Let's get the hell out of here, Beth. I've got a plan that might get us both out of this mess. Ah, here we are. Home sweet home. Alright, so this looks like his place. It's got some guards. Alright. Okay. Well, what do you want me to do here, man? Alright, let me... So here's what I need you to do. Alright, what do you need me to do, man? To where those bandits live. Okay. And wipe them out. Hell yeah! No one walks out alive. That's just what I wanted to do. I like it. You can use one of my ATVs in the garage, and that pistol, and the supplies on the table. Oh, and you won't just get my thanks. Come back alive and I'll dig up some armor that'll fit over that arc suit you're wearing. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah. I love it. I'm here to save the world, so let me go ahead and start shooting some shit. Alright, so it says talk is cheap in this world, action is needed. First take the pistol and supplies from the counter, then grab one of the ATVs and head north to the ghost hideout. Don't come back until they're completely wiped out. And he's going to give me some uh, armor if I do this. I like it. One more thing. Yes. Those bandits shouldn't be too hard to take down. Not for you. Okay. I hear there's something special about you, Ark people. You need to find their hideout and take care of the problem. It's us or them, and they'll be coming. Use when nanotrites are too slow. Alright, so. Some kind of. Wait, actually, hold on. Let me see that again. Let's see. Assign. Unassign. Quick use. I got other stuff in here. Engineering. Armory. So it shows my fists. 
upgrade equipped, which I've done. There's my quest tab, time played, recipes uh, collected, vehicle jumps, items looted, shots fired. That's pretty cool, man. It gives you all a, a stat layout on that. All right, so let's go ahead and see if there's anything else up in here real quick. All right, doesn't look like there's much. All right, so you won't let me use that, but I can use the ATV. Pretty simple stuff. Let's go, boy. Press shift to boost. The hell is breaking. I like it, man. All right, guys. So I can't drive that vehicle. I don't know what I'm getting into. Okay, that head bob's got to go, man. Is there any way to get the head bob out of there? Okay. All right, I don't see anything for a head bob. See if it's under video. No. Okay. Looks like I'm stuck with the head bob, man. All right, ghost hideout. Here we go. Don't be afraid to get your hands dirty. Maliwa attacks can save your life. You can loot bodies by getting close and pressing E. Make sure to loot every body you find to stay stocked on ammo, ingredients, and cash. Alright. So I found some food cans and some money and some pistol rounds. Nice. All right, nothing down that way. I'm ready to jump into some combat, man. Beer bottles. I'm not sure what they do. Huffer's aerosol. Bunch of stuff over there. What's this right here? Bandages. Bullet rounds. All right. Radio. Some kind of lock. You 
You must have a lock grinder to open this door. You can build them in the engineering dowser. You have the schematic and the parts. All right, so you'll be able to actually build that. That's pretty cool. Is that somebody talking to me, or is that me talking to myself? Okay. I'm not sure what cloth rags will do. Can I search things? All right. No, I can't. It's over this way. All right. It doesn't look like much. What the? The hell are trying to aim, man. Alright, so I can't beat down the door. I was trying that. Let's see what these collector's cards are. I, I don't uh, really understand what they are, so let's see. Collector's cards. Collector's cards used to play Rage Frenzy when combined with the starter deck. See Hendrick in Wellsprings. Kind of mini game. All right. Let's see. Now I've already got two bandages. Let's see. Cloth rags. Better clean these suckers off before wrapping your injured bits into them. So it's an ingredient. Food cans, collection of food cans. Cat food is a wasteland delicacy. All right. Uh, books, collection of books found around the wasteland. No one reads, but they make uh, good cook fires. Okay. Collection of empty beer bottles. If only the golden liquid was still in them. So those are sellable. That's trash. And a collection of useless junk you've picked up. Just sell it. All right. It does look like there's a certain number of slots that I can actually have. Not sure what, uh. Not sure what my hit points are, man. How do you find out what your hit points are? This UI needs some work, man. That's the thing I don't like about it. Alright, so my health is 100%, so I'm back fine. So maybe it's one of those systems where the more damage you take, the screen starts to. starts to turn red. All right, fellas, here we go. Beautiful. To right or left. All right, so that goes back up to the top part that we were just at. There's nothing up this way. That's nobody I know.
What the fuck? Well, well. Look at what Hagar said to us. How dare you think you can walk into our house? Take him to the kill. All right. Alright, so I'm going to wait for him to... Once the nodes have charged, they shoot towards each other. Okay. Alright. Well, that was bullshit. Okay. I didn't know it was going to go that fast, so I mean, shit. All right. That is pretty gross, man. Can I get up there? Okay, so it is. I can save the game. New save. I'll select it. There we go. All right. Go ahead and resume the game. Oh yeah, I'm shifty. I'm not hiding. Get your ass out of there. Yeah, baby. All right, we knocked them all out. Let's go ahead and search them. I 
That's pretty cool. Getting some loot, guys. This music's kind of repetitive, though. I gotta tell you. I'm talking about bandages nice Boys, we are just wrecking through them. Did I search him? All right, there we go. Nice. Cool. You can loot the vending machines. All right, I'm gonna turn down this music, guys. This is a little too loud for me. Uh, let's see here. Audio, too uh, repetitive, I guess is a good word for it. All right, there we go. Let's turn that down to about right there. That's a little better. Oh yeah? Beautiful. Now I could hop down through there. I'm just gonna go ahead and go this way for a second. There we go. All right. Ooh, grenades. Quick eye. F2 to select them and Q to use. Yeah, I bet it does.
I had to shot him in the ass. the zip line back down. All right. It's pretty cool. Can I jump over this? No, nope. can't jump over that. All right, guys. Let's do the zip line. Going back the way I came. Entering into the wasteland. Survival tip. The wasteland is a dangerous place. Be sure to save early and often. All right. Kind of on rails at the moment. What's this? Uh, Stanley Express mailboxes. Mailbox is always looking for drivers willing to make dangerous inquire at Wellspring for more details. All right. Yeah, baby. Love it. You got some air right there. I can tell this is going to be a fun part to do. All right. Let's go see what Hagar has to say, man. Remember to visit Halleck, the Hagar settlement vendor. He'll buy all the junk you collected. All right. Sounds good to me. Good work. We're all a little safer because of that. That's right. You got our thanks and that suit of armor I promised. But as you can see, we got other trouble. Oh, yeah? Listen, the settlement was attacked while you were gone. Bunch of bandits we've never seen before. They didn't take anything, they just came for the kill. We have some good people hurt. And we're running low on medical supplies. I'm going to need your help again. Okay. Just past the hill across the way, you'll find another settlement. They tend to stick to themselves, but they're friends. And they have what we need. Just give this letter to Richter. He'll know what to do. If you help me again, I'll make sure our mechanic in town sets you up with your own buggy. What do you say? All right, sounds good. So I get my own vehicle. All right. Thank you. And before you go, make sure you've got everything you need. Ammo, wing sticks. If not, see Halleck. He's right under the old sign out front. I need you to find the outrigger settlement and return here with those medical supplies. All right. So let's go to the inventory real quick. So I've got that. Let's see a letter for uh, Dan requesting medical supplies. Got some grenades. None of this stuff really looks like it's going to be very valuable. But let's go ahead and let's talk to Becky real quick. Please hurry back with those supplies. If we are raided again, we will surely need them. Thank you. Okay. He's sleeping. All right. Let's go check out the vendor. There's a shop down there. Let me guess. You want to know how to throw a wingstick. 
Ain't easy, friend. Huh. I see Dan gave you a pistol. Not a bad weapon, but if you want some subtle killing power, you'll need to use a wing stick. They've got a nano core for smart targeting, but it'll still take a little practice to master. I'll make a deal with you. You prove you can hit something with them, and I'll tell how it gets safe to sell you some. Ready to give it a toss? Learning to throw a wing stick may save your life, and I'm the best teacher around. It's pretty simple. Just throw the wing stick at your target, and the nano core will do the rest. If the wing stick survives impact, it'll fly back to where you tossed it, so don't move around too much. Okay. Good hunting. All right, here are the rules. Watch for the pop-up targets and hit them as quickly as you can. See how many you can get before the timer runs out. Rules are simple. Hit as many targets as you can before the timer runs out. So I passed. I can use a wing nice stick now. Job. If I were a target drone, I'd be nervous. Talk to Halleck and he can set you up. Okay, so now I have five wing sticks. Alright. Damn bandits. Attacked while you're gone. We drove them off, but they still did a good amount of damage. All right. Let's go check out the shop real quick. Welcome, stranger. Name's Halleck, and it's a pleasure meeting you. I run this little shop. Got enough supplies here to keep you alive and fighting. Best stuff in the wasteland. Oh, and uh, if you find something of value and you don't need it, bring it here. All right. I pay nicely for quality goods. Care to uh, browse my selection? Of course. I might have something you need. Let's see. I want to sell items. Um. So I want to sell those. Sell those. That. Now, I don't think we eat, so I'm going to go ahead and sell that as well. All right, so let me close that up. We've got 270. Half a binocular, the good half. 25. So let's go ahead and... Um, sure. All right. I don't see any of this stuff. Okay, all right. What do we got here? Grenades, those, ammo. So let's purchase a bunch of these. Let's see, it gives you 12 rounds. I like it. Let's just go ahead and purchase a couple more. All right, so I've got over 100 bullets. Hope to see you again soon. All right. So how do you use the monocle? Okay, wait. All right, so it's usable. Okay, well, let's use it. Badass, guys. Check it out, dude. I like it. Hell yeah. Alright, fellas. So, the next step is to go to that settlement. Deliver that note. I think this is a good stopping point for this uh, gameplay. On Rage, we're going to look at to see exactly what the mechanics are like. Seems like a pretty cool game. Um, won't know until I dive more into it. It's got a little bit of a Borderlands feel to it. It's got a little bit of a more of an FPS shooter feel to it. A little more arcadey than Borderlands. And uh, 
doesn't really have a uh, Fallout vibe to it yet, like a Fallout 3 or anything like that. But I kind of dig it, and I kind of like the setting. I'd like to see what uh, they're going to be doing for Rage 2. But uh, anyway, I just wanted to go ahead and do a quick gameplay on this. I may do some more. Who knows? I just uh, kind of wanted to throw this out here with something kind of fun to do on a Sunday. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and sign out, guys. This is Dungeon J. Have a great day gaming. Later.